Welcome, 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 everybody. We're going to be getting this party started in just a second. Hang tight. What's going on? What's going on? I hope everybody is feeling absolutely amazing today. <clears throat> if you're on this call, you're definitely in for a treat. My name is Dakara J. And um, if you guys want to go ahead and share where you're calling in from, you can go ahead and do that before we get started. If you feel led to do so, share where you're from and what your name is. Can everyone hear me okay? Yes, Yamil from the STL, St. Louis Mo. Let's go. All right, all right, all right. Now, like I said, um, thank you for that. My name is Jakar J. And um, I've been trading uh, officially a year and it's completely changed my whole life. And this is just the beginning. Um, the individual that we're about to bring on the line, she is actually the person that really inspired um the changes is happening she invited me out to north carolina she said look jakar just come out so you can see for yourself and um i was a little bit nervous because i didn't believe in myself right but what happens when you get around powerful leaders when you get around powerful beings that you can actually borrow their belief right i was like you know this is this might be too much for me but she said you know what jakar you know, I think you have what it takes. And she does this for our entire community, which is almost um, 200 people. She does it. That's how she shows up. And if you're coming on the line, please go ahead and mute yourself. Please, please, please go ahead and mute your line. Because I don't want anybody to miss out on this uh, trillion dollar information. Because that's what's going to happen, right? So like I said, this individual, she, I, I borrowed her belief. And as a result, I've been able to leave my job. My biggest day trading, no income claims, is uh, has been two thousand dollars. I wouldn't make that in corporate. And so, um, like I said, when this person is coming on the line, just know that she's speaking from her heart. Just know that she's speaking from over three years of experience. Just know she's come from the bottom up, sleeping in vehicles and in sheds. And instead of saying "Whoa, it's me," she said, "Oh, this happened to me," and I want other people to benefit from that. So put your hearts and your ears on the phone and please get your pen and paper out for the individual I'm bringing on the line today. Her name is Isis Love, okay? AKA Freaky Pips, okay? Are you on the line? Hello, 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 hello. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you so much, Jakar. Let's definitely give it back to Jakar, you guys. Um, she's doing some phenomenal things in our community. And like she said, you know, at first she didn't believe in herself, but when you're around, when you're surrounded around people that's winning, what do you think happens to you? Well, you catch on fire, right? You, you catch on fire to the point where you're winning too, you guys. So tonight, um, I'm not going to be long, but I'm definitely going to be strong, you know, in this, uh, what I'm going to be showing you guys, because I really feel like it's something important, right? I really feel like it's uh, something really that can take you to that next level, right? It's something that can take you to that next level. So I'm gonna go ahead and dive into it. You see me with my handy dandy whiteboard, right? Got my whiteboard kicking out. Uh, give me one second, you guys. Okay, cool. All right, cool. I'm live on Facebook. Let's go. So look, check this out, y'all. And I hope y'all taking notes because money makers is no takers right now technically in life there's only two ways to make money and you gotta ask yourself where are you at right either you're working for money meaning you at a job meaning you selling some type of products you selling some type of services you're working for your money right or your money is working for you where Right? Where are you at? Ask yourself today. Is your money working for you? 
or you working for your money, right? So check this out, y'all. Something called the cash flow quadrant, right? The cash flow quadrant. Now, remember, there's only two ways. So let's say work for money, right? And let's just put on this side, money works for you. Now, I'm not the best writer, so that's why I'm telling you guys to take notes. So you ain't got to kind of be squinting your eyes, right? Now, on the, on the left side of money, which is the wrong side of money, it's the wrong side. Why is it the wrong side? Because you're working for your money, right? Now, I want you guys to know, we're not bashing jobs, but we are high up on opportunities, right? Because we know a job can only take you but so far. Right, so when we think about that, right, we think about the first quadrant is the E quadrant. That's the employee quadrant, right? So 60% of the world make up the employee quadrant. Think about it. Think about how many friends and how many people you know right now that is an employee, right? Meaning that they got a job. And what does job stand for? Just over broke just over broke you get just enough of money to survive right one second y'all let me get my um let me get my uh charger my bad right so you get just enough money to get by that's a serious thing you guys that's something serious right now what happens is you're exchanging time for money. Somebody was supposed to be on this call tonight, but she said, hey, my job called me in. I can't make the call. I mean, think about that. You don't even control your own time. Somebody literally can call you up on the phone and say, hey, I want you to come into work. And you can't do nothing about it. Because guess what? If you don't come to work, you're not going to get paid, right? Now, let's talk about this next quadrant, self-employed. Now, a lot of y'all get this confused with a business owner, but you're not a business owner. You're self-employed. Now, can come, anybody come off mute and give me a couple self-employed businesses or self-employed, yeah, businesses? Selling um, handmade body products like shea butters and things like that. Handmade body products. That's a big one. A lot of people think that they're a business on the selling products. Anything else? Come on. I don't want to talk to myself on this call. I came here to be with y'all. I could be doing something else, right? So somebody else, give me one more. Possibly selling T-shirts. There you go, thank you. Selling t-shirts. Now look, that's cool. It's a step up. It's a step up, right? However, you're not a business owner. Why? Because you have time, I mean, you have money, right? But you ain't got no time. Why? Because if you ain't selling shirts, you ain't making no money. If you ain't selling shea butter, you are not making no money. So that means your money is not working for you. Once again, you're working for your money. 35% of the world is doing this. Now we add these numbers up, 60 and 35. That's 95% of the population working for money. Y'all gotta really think about this. You got, I mean, tonight, this is what I want y'all to do. Tonight, if you don't do anything else, I want you to think, right? Because a lot of times we don't think, we just go with the flow. I'm just going with the flow. But when you go with the flow, you don't go, you're not going with a direction, right? So how the heck is 95% of the world working for their money? That's a head scratcher for me. Now check this out. This is the right side of money. This is where y'all need to be at tonight. Because I know half of y'all are working for your money. Right? So at the end of this call, you got 
you got a choice. Either you're going to work for your money for the rest of your life, or you're going to try something different where you can get ahead of the game where your money's working for you. It's just that simple, right? So business owner, true business owners, only 4% of the world make up business owners. And you're probably thinking, okay, this is cute. I know this. But then if you know it, you wouldn't be in the position, right? Now, when we think about a business owner, let me give you all the greatest example ever. Your boss. Your boss is a true business owner. Because guess what? If you work at Wells Fargo, is the owner of Wells Fargo being a teller? If you work at Chick-fil-A, is the owner of Chick-fil-A right there with you frying chicken? Y'all come off mute and let me know if your CEO who has created the company is working with you. No. No, no. no. Hell no. Right? So I said, hell no. So that should make you, that, 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 see, that should make you scratch your head, though. That should make you scratch your head. Because guess what? While you're slaving, yes, slaving, right? Because a job is a new modern slavery, no matter what your color is, right? What you're doing is you're building up your boss's legacy. See, we like to call ourselves queens and kings. What up, king? What up, queen? But you ain't no king and queen if you ain't building no legacy. How you gonna be a king and queen when you don't even have a legacy that you're building. We use these titles so loosely. You get what I'm saying? Because guess what? When you're working hard, Bob is on the beach. When you're building up Bob's empire so that his kids and his kids' kids can be taken care of, they at the beach, bro. You working hard for them and they at the beach. But what are you doing for your family? You got to ask yourself, some of y'all got kids. How bad do you really love your kids? Because if you just depending on a job, you can't leave that to your kids. But if you're a business owner, oh, now we're in business, baby. So today we're going to be talking about how to become a business owner and an investor. 1% of the population is an investor. What is an investor? An investor's money makes money for them. As I'm talking to y'all right now, I'm in a couple of trades. My money is making money for me. I don't have to be over here. I haven't worked a job in six years. I'll never go back to a job. I'll never sell my soul to a job again. Right? Because giving your time to a job is like selling your soul to the devil. Now, granted, we all got to start somewhere. Hell yeah, I used to work a job back in the day. Shit, I started working a job when I was 12. But it's up to you to ask yourself, are you going to continue to work a job? See, an investor wakes up in the morning when they're done sleep. When I woke up today, I didn't wake up because my alarm clock said, Isis, you got to go to work. I woke up because I was done sleeping. I was like, oh, Ooh, that was some good sleep. <laughs> How am I going to start my day? I just got back from Vegas and L.A. I didn't have to ask for no days off. I just got up and go. I just went online, booked my ticket. Boom, I was there. All of y'all deserve that. You're all grown. Why are you asking another grown man and a grown woman, can you take leave? Why are you asking another grown man, especially my man, come on, y'all. Why are y'all asking another grown man if you can go on a lunch break? You should be able to eat when you want to eat. Not when somebody tell you to eat. Y'all, that's slavery, right? So when you add up these two numbers, four plus one, five percent. Now, this is what y'all got to think about it. Why does 95% of the people, the masses, the people in the matrix give their money to 5% of the world. And why is it that 5% of the world own 95% of the money? Y'all gotta think about that, right? I hope y'all wrote this down. I hope y'all wrote this down because if you didn't, 
You're setting your kids up for failure because nobody taught you about financial literacy and nobody's going to teach your kids about financial literacy. The school ain't going to teach them. So let me ask y'all something. If you don't know how money works and your kids don't know how money works, how, what do you think is going to happen to your kids' kids? Somebody come off mute and tell them. Just over broke. Just over broke. Cat must have got the tongue on some of y'all. Got y'all over there thinking. Just straight up. If you don't teach your kids, where the hell are they going to learn? If they don't learn, what's going to the same cycle? Think about your parents. I'm thinking about mine. My mother didn't know anything about money. Her mother didn't know anything about money. Therefore, I grew up not knowing anything about money. Woo, I'm so glad that I was the black sheep of the family and I was able to be on another level, right? And make a difference for my bloodline. But all your kids might not be the black sheep, right? Now, and I want y'all to know, it's gonna be some gut punchers tonight, but it's because you need to think. Sometimes we don't think, that's why we're in the situations we in. Right now, check this out. We're talking about Forex. What is Forex? Let me tell y'all something. <laughs> when somebody called me up and they told me about Forex, I thought they wanted me to do something for my ex. <laughs> right? I literally thought they wanted me to do something for my ex. F O R E X. Forex. Forex. Now, some of y'all are familiar with stocks. Now, we trade stocks on the Forex market, but this ain't stocks. Let me give y'all a couple fun facts. I hope y'all writing this down because money makers are note takers. And I think somebody got a guest named o Oya, o -O La on the phone. Y'all might wanna hit her up because her mic is not working. She need to go out and come back in. So when you think about the Forex market, it's dealing with currencies. So if we all was to travel to Australia right now, right? Australian people don't use U.S. money, right? So what would happen is we would exchange, right, the U.S. dollar for the, uh, the U Australian dollar. Simple. Stocks is dealing with companies. Tesla, Nike, you know, Uber, and so on. Now the Forex market is over five trillion dollars every 24 hours there's over five trillion dollars being circulated right now as it is with stocks it's only a 22 billion dollar a day industry right two more fun facts i just want y'all to catch the the difference before i show y'all this school right now, the Forex market is open six days a week, 24 seven. So if you get off work at 11 at night, 12 at night, one o'clock in the morning, you're still able to trade and make money on this market, on your cell phone, okay? Now, if you're only relying on stocks, you only can trade stocks Monday through Friday, nine to five that's it you limited on your money we don't want no limitations on our money we don't want no limitations it's already bad enough that we've been slaving for money now you want to put limitations on my money nah let me tell y'all two more fun facts with forex we make money when the market goes up and down with stocks you only make money when the market rises up last fun fact the forex market is recession proof well, what is a recession, ISIS? A recession is what we're going through right now. The freaking economy is crashing. She has to hit the connect the audio button, y'all. She's not hitting that connect the audio. Oh, la. She's not hitting connect to audio. So we're going through a recession right now. Right? So what's happening to stocks? Stocks are plummeting. Some of them won't come back up. Now, with Forex... Forex is recession proof. 
Y'all, we've been partying it up on this recession. Some people, I mean, shout out to all the families who's been through some type of, you know, corona stuff. But you guys, we've been making money off this coronavirus. And see, what y'all don't know is that rich, successful people create events like the corona just to come up. Right? I'm not saying it's not real. I'm not here to debate about it. But one thing I will tell y'all, though, is that people create stuff so they can come up and be rich. So you got to ask yourself, do you want to be on the 95% or the 5%? So let's get into this school, y'all. Let's get into this school because this is what y'all meant. Y'all came to, to check out, right? Let's go to the school. So I'm gonna um I'm gonna pull something up for y'all. Right? I'm gonna pull something up. Y'all gonna like this. Y'all gonna really like this. Now, this is how I want y'all to think about this school, right? Now, it's just like any school, except this is a money school. So your school that we went to, it taught us how to conform. It taught us how to be employees. It taught us how to work for other people, right? But it never taught us how to get our money to work for us. One second, y'all. Let me switch some stuff up. If y'all enjoying this call so far, I want y'all to drop some 77s in the chat bar. I gotta see who I'm working with. Drop some 77s in the chat bar. If you're learning something that you didn't know, drop some 77s, baby. I got to see who I'm working with in this group, right? That's what I'm talking about, y'all, Mill. All right, y'all, so check this out, right? And I want y'all to know, like like I said, I, I'm, I didn't come from a silver spoon type of a, a family. I'm nobody special. Um, quite frankly, I wasn't the best in school especially when it came to math. So if I can do it, sheesh, y'all can do it too, right? Y'all, you know what? Y'all so powerful, you can do anything. You just gotta have the faith. And you gotta have a burning desire. Y'all, I've been doing this for three years straight. I haven't even looked up. I haven't even caught a breath. I haven't even stopped. I've been doing this non-stop. No quitting, no taking no breaks. Straight up, learning this skill and helping other people get this bag, right? Helping other people get this bag, y'all. So, all right, cool. So this is our school, y'all. Here's the school right here. And this is the school that's going to teach you step by step on how to become a profitable Forex trader, cryptocurrency trader. We got binary options. We can teach you how to do stocks on the Forex market. There's no limitation to what you can learn in this school. See, this school is way different from the average school that you're used to going to. The average school wants to teach you how to be a slave. We're teaching you how to be a boss. Choose at the end of the call, what do you want to do? Do you want to go back to your job and be a slave? Or do you want to be a boss? Because we're going to know it. At the end of the call, whoever invited you, they're going to hit you up. Just tell them straight up, hey, look, I want to continue to be a slave. Or tell them straight up, hey, look, I want to be a boss. It's only two choices. There's no in-between. There's no in-between, right? So check this out. So we're going to go to the academies. Um, you guys, we're in over 100 countries. So we have multiple languages. Shout out to my G12 family. We just had a beautiful young lady start from Ghana. We got people in Ghana. We got people in China. Shout out to Debo. We got people in China. I got some people coming in from Guam. Don't y'all understand how this is changing up the economical structure in some of these countries who don't get paid a lot of money? Now they can take that little bit of money that they make and multiply it on the largest freaking financial market there is out there. That's powerful, y'all. So we're going to go to English because I'm taking it that most of us speak English. Right? All right. Now. 
the very first video is what is Forex? Right there. If you don't know what it is and you didn't understand the, the definition that I gave you, I'm gonna let this um I'm gonna play a little bit of it so y'all can um see the uh the clearness of it. But and it's only four minutes. Let me ask y'all something. I want y'all to be real. Y'all can and I, I'm screaming live on Facebook. So if y'all hear me on Facebook, type it down in Facebook. And if you're here, let me know. Y'all come off mute. How many of you guys, honestly, I want y'all to be so honest tonight. Tonight is keep it real Wednesday. How many of you guys honestly spend about 30 minutes to an hour on social media? Facts. Facts, right? I do. Okay, Jakar, who else? All right, some people don't want to keep it real, but hey, look, y'all ain't got to keep it real with me. <laughs> <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You ain't got to keep it real with me, baby, because you got to convince yourself, right? So check this. When you look at the word spin and you take off the S and P, that's it. It's over. It's ended. So this is an excuse that people like to come up with. And let me tell you where excuses come up from. Fear. False evidence appearing real. We'll be so hard online, hitting them with the flex, hitting them with the flex, be, be so scary in the inside. So scary. And so the first excuse that you're going to try to come up with is, oh, ISIS, I don't, I don't have enough time. I'm a single dad. I'm a single mom. Excuse, 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 excuse. But you got time for social media, though. You'll make time to go on your timeline to watch other people's lives. You get what I'm saying? Ooh, don't come with me with no excuses, baby. Right? So look, this video is four minutes and 41 seconds. Y'all, some of y'all, when the first thing y'all do when y'all wake up in the morning is y'all grab y'all phone. You straight grab that phone. Soon as you roll over, you still got crust in your eye. You pick up that phone. How about you pick up the phone and watch this video? Now I'm gonna play a little bit of it. I'm not gonna play it all. I'm gonna show you a preview. Y'all notice I'm not giving y'all no slides. I'm getting straight to the point. I'm not here to convince y'all. Your bank account alone should do the convincing. Your bank account should convince you enough that you need to do something different. I'm gonna play this real quick. Now it's gonna bluffer. I got AT&T, y'all. <laughs> I'm play it back a little bit. Welcome to the IM Mastery Academy for Forex. In this course, we'll be talking about what is FRX. Forex can be professionally abbreviated as as FX or FRX. All right, y'all. This basically. If you want to know more, get in the academy. I'm not going to get deep, but what I did want to show y'all is this ain't no uh, Tom and Jeffrey and Matthew uh, down the street who decided to go on YouTube and teach people how to trade. You guys, this is a billion dollar school. A billion dollar school. Now, some of y'all are going to try to be so cheap. You don't deserve cheap. Cheap is what got you in the position where you are now. Cheap is why you are in the position you are in now. Don't you think that you deserve better than cheap? Now, if you, if you think you deserve cheap, hey, I ain't got nothing to do about it. But I'm talking for the people who know that they come from kings and queens. I'm talking to the people who know that they're supposed to be living a luxurious life. Y'all, you got to invest into yourself. Y'all be quick to go get the new phone. This is Samsung 10 or a, a 10E. This thing probably cost me $900. I went to go get it with grace and ease. 
Some of y'all got the new iPhone. Y'all didn't even bat an eye at the price. So why not invest into your education? See, the problem is we got 95% of people working for money. They don't think. They don't think. The masses. Do y'all know what wealthy people call the average people? The masses. When you think about the masses, I think about cattle being herded. People are literally being herded. I'm telling you, get out the herd. Take the right pill. I'm Morpheus. I got the red pill and I got the blue pill. I got the pill that's going to have you stay at your job and I got the pill that's going to help you change your, change your lifestyle. What pill do you want? Put it in the chat bar. Tell me what pill that you want. Right? Now check this out, y'all. Check this out. All, everything is laid down for y'all, module to module. The history of Forex. What is traded in the Forex market? Who's participating in it? Like the banks, the government, hedge funding. Your bank is trading your money. Let me tell y'all a secret. If you got money in the bank, show me what you drink. Now, nah, if y'all got money in the bank, right? Your bank is trading your money on the foreign exchange market. Now, you're already getting pimped, enslaved at a job. Now, the bank is pimping you even more by trading your money on the foreign exchange market. Look, y'all, y'all ain't got time to be being pimped. If they gonna be trading, why not you learn how to do what the bank's doing? Because if you don't learn this, guess what? Y'all gonna continue to let the banks pimp you. That's just a shame, right? So everything about Forex is right here. Now check this out, excuse number two, based off of fear. But you can flex online, but really this is intimidating you. It's even intimidating some of y'all grown men on this line. Y'all be hard in the mud on the streets, but y'all letting something so small intimidate you. The second excuse is, oh, well, ISIS, oh, uh, oh, uh, ISIS, I, I got I to gotta do my research. What the frick are you researching? I already told you what the Forex market is. I already told you how big it is. Everything that you want to know is right here. Let me tell y'all something. I know y'all heard your car at the beginning. Y'all, I used to live in my car. I went from living in a Dodge Ram 1500 with my ex-partner, to live it in a small, tiny shed, probably about the size of your bathroom. What I had to research was my bank account. Remember, time is your greatest asset. You don't have time double backing, researching something I already told you. If you want to take some time researching something, I want y'all to come closer. Come closer to the screen. Come a little closer. I'm going to come closer too. If you want to take some time researching something, research your bank account. See why your bank account looking like gas prices. And gas is pretty freaking low. You got to ask yourself, Travis, Sammy, Jakara, why in the last past three to five years has my bank account not really grown. That's what you need to research. You need to call the FBI out on that one. Why do you keep working a job that's not giving you any money? Come on, y'all. Y'all got to think tonight. Man, y'all got to think. Y'all been bamboozled. We all been bamboozled. We've been bamboozled. Slaving, generational poverty, after bloodline, after bloodline. <sighs> Crazy. That's why when I found this out, I ain't hesitate. I believed in myself enough. I'm asking you guys that if you don't believe in yourself, borrow my belief. Jakar told you, Jakar has been doing this for a year, but let's be frank, let's be quite honest. She hasn't been taking it serious until four months. She sat right on my couch that I'm looking at right now about two months ago and she turned about 20 or 30 cents into over $2,000. Now let me ask y'all something.
Does anybody on YouTube, I mean, anybody on Facebook, um, anybody on Facebook or anybody on this call make 2000 a, a, a day at your job? Crickets. <laughs> Straight cr crickets. It's not going to happen. Not unless you're selling some type of drugs. So I want y'all to, I want y'all to really just, man, I want y'all just to pay attention. And I want y'all to know, I'm not yelling at y'all. I just get so passionate because I know how this has helped me. And not only me, shout out to, man, oh my gosh, we had so many people leaving their jobs. Shout out to uh, Butter, Marjorie, shout out to G Netta, who I just read a message. He said he left his job. Shout out to Rosalind, who left her job. You guys, we got people leaving their stinking, crusty jobs. Claiming their time back. So check this out. This next thing I'm going to show y'all, ooh, it's called Smart Money TV. Now, let me tell y'all something about Smart Money TV. I got to mute somebody's line, Mr. Travis, right? Smart Money TV, if y'all got cable at home, I want you to turn your cable off because your cable is making you dumb. TV don't make you smart. It keeps you entertained. And quite frankly, some of y'all would rather be entertained than y'all would educated. Seriously. Y'all would rather sit on the couch laughing at the TV show than doing something different with y'all life. Not everybody. I'm only talking to a small amount of people because only a small amount of y'all are looking for change. The rest of y'all going to go back to your job tomorrow. Right? Now, I call this smart money TV. Why? Because you can watch these live educators. It's over 180 channels, and you can make money live with them. Let me ask y'all something. When y'all watching a basketball game, uh, do y'all get paid for doing that? Somebody come on mute. Let me know. Nope. Not at all. It's good, though, watching them dribble the ball back down the court, shooting in that little hole. It's cool. I mean, I used to play basketball, street ball. Didn't pay me. I'm inviting you guys to open your brains up. I just want you to think tonight. Right? So check this out. Just today alone, over 68,000 people tuned in to watch her channel today. Let me tell y'all something. If, if a show was dumb, people wouldn't tune in. If something wasn't working, people would not tune in. These are some of the top educators. They're not everybody, but just some of the top. The, all these numbers that you see is the amount of people so far, and the, the day is still young. It's only 8 o'clock. These numbers can go up even more. So check this out, y'all. We got binary options, cryptocurrency, Forex. Let's let's watch one of these channels. Let's see what we got today. All right, let's see. Now this is gonna trip y'all out. Sheesh! This look just like y'all TV guy. <laughs> look at that. Let me tell you, I haven't had cable in 12 years. That was 12 years ago. I just decided I'll never get cable again. It's hard to watch TV. I got I just brought a new TV just so I can look at the trading screen bigger. When I try to sit down and, 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 and live a normal, average, human, everyday person's life, it's hard to watch TV. I have to force myself. It's so freaking hard. It's so much yeah. nonsense. What was that? I say it's hard. I don't do it. Yeah, it's hard, man. All these shows, and then half the time, it's the same stuff. Somebody getting beat. Somebody selling drugs. Somebody cheating on yep. somebody. It's the same stuff, man. I just, yeah. I just bought a laptop strictly for this this school wow yep, yep. it's real powerful, man powerful so check this out y'all these people come on different times that means it's gonna be based off of your time zone i mean your schedule see we're teaching you how to be a boss bosses set their own schedule 
Bosses don't let other people set their schedule. Bosses don't have other people telling them when to come to work. Tonight, are you going to be a boss or are you going to be a slave? Two choices. There's no middle. <laughs> There's no middle. <laughs> There's no middle, y'all. You got to choose. Like, what do you want to do? All right? So let's, let's uh, pick on this person right here. Right? So Oren Wright used to have three freaking stinking jobs. I want you guys to know, if you love your job, no disrespect. We're not downing jobs. All we're saying is your job is not going to buy your mama a brand new house. Your job is not going to put you in a position where you can travel at will when you want to first class or maybe even on a freaking jet. That 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 25, $30 an hour ain't going to cut it. Right? So look at this live. Let's watch this. He ain't live right now, but let's look at one of his recordings. Look how fun he makes it. Hold on. Look at this. Look so the current market is hanging out around this level. We got a resistance level here at the top. All of this is going to be my resistance. Okay. And this right here, that's another support area. All right, you see how we identifying our support areas already? Here's another support area. Support is on the bottom. Okay, support here. Resistance on the top. So this part is resistance because the markets is... All right, we're not going to get too deep. I just want y'all to see that you have the opportunity to be on here with this guy who's making six, seven figures trading. I don't know. Some of y'all don't know what six to seven figures is. Shit, before I got into this industry, I didn't even know what a six figures was. I didn't know what no seven figures was. Seven figures, what does that mean? That means they make it 100K and up. 100K and up. If you ain't making 100K, then baby, you need to be on this smart money TV. So check this out. Let's just say you can't catch it live. I know how y'all like the binge watch series. How many of you guys like to just watch an episode? Because I'm not even going to lie. When I used to watch uh, The Walking Dead, sometimes I let the episodes, uh, like, stack up, and then I'll just sit down and watch all of the episodes. How many of you guys like to watch, like, episode after episode? I do. Okay, cool. A couple people are nervous. They're like, oh, shit, I don't want her to call me out. Well, check this out. Y'all ain't got to keep it real with me. Keep it real with yourself. Right? So the same way you like to binge watch your TV shows, I'm giving you the opportunity to binge watch something that's going to change your bank account. I'm giving you an opportunity to be educated versus entertained. So just like in school, when you didn't understand something, teacher, 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 I don't understand. You raise your freaking hand up, right? Well, guess what you do here? Oh, I gotta almost finish this call. Guess what you do here? You just ax it in the tap bar. Hey, Oren, I don't understand what you did. Just ask the question. Y'all don't overcomplicate this. Don't let this intimidate you. It's new. Of course you don't know what's going on. Of course you're a beginner. We all were beginners. We all were beginners at first. Don't let this intimidate you. There's nothing, y'all tell me, somebody tell me another position you can do where you can grow money off your cell phone. You see what I'm saying? There's nothing else, y'all. There's nothing else. What, see, cause you don't have to sell. You don't have to recruit. I can sit right here, watch this, and make money and don't need none of y'all to join me. You get what I'm saying? So if you don't do this, what else are you gonna do? Side hustles? How far is slanging shea butter gonna take you? How far is selling t-shirts gonna take you? How far is doing tarot card readings gonna take you? We gotta think long money. I want my money so long that when I die and leave this world, 
my money's still gonna be out 12 generations. Some of y'all, when y'all die and leave this world, your money's not even gonna reach your kids. Wake up, y'all. I'm telling you, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Right? This last thing I'm gonna show y'all, cause I don't wanna overcook the grits. I got another class I wanna teach. And like I said, I'm not in the convincing business. Definitely not in the convincing business. I'll let the bank accounts do that. All right? So check this out. Now, I don't know about y'all, but like I said, math was not my subject. So if you think that Forex is about math, I got a surprise for y'all. It's not. The most math that you're going to do is adding and subtraction. Guess what? If you can't add or subtract, don't even trip, baby. <laughs> Pull this good old calculator out, baby. <laughs> right? Use that calculator. Don't even trip. Math was my weakness. I copied ninth grade up to 11th grade because I didn't go to 12th grade. I graduated early. Right? But from ninth to 11th grade, I cheated. <laughs> I'm inviting y'all to cheat too. You may not be one of those people that cheated in school, but you're going to want to cheat with this. You guys, this thing is 87% accurate. It's telling you when to enter. You don't even got to think. Somebody asked me how hard this will be. Will it be hard for you to copy and paste? Is that too hard for y'all? We got some fun. Okay, cool. Let me see. I, I guess it's just me and Travis and Jakar today. It's really, and y'all meal, it's just, we the only ones on this call today. Y'all must be the ones that's going to get started. Right? So check this out. We oh, grow. Check, check this out. Check this out. Y'all like to keep it real. That's one thing about me. I'm one of the friends you need to have around you because I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to keep it real with you. Right? So check this out. So basically what this market is saying is, hey, Yamil, if you get in this trade and you put these numbers right here in the trading app, which everybody should have the trading app, is Meta Trader 4. If you put these numbers in your app, we're going to help you make money. This thing helps you make money. Let's look at an old one. And what I mean by old one, I mean I'm going to look at one that already made the money. Let's look at this one. Look, there was the entry. The candle was going, going, going. These are candles. These blue and red things are candles. Going, 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 boing. Look at how these candles hit this blue dotted line. That means that if you would have had this number in your cell phone and you copied from the harmonic scanner, that's 87% accurate, which we know it's not hard to copy, you would have cashed out. How much would you would have cashed out, Isis? How much money would I want to cash down? Let's talk about how much money you want to cash down. Oh, Miss Jones, Mr. Jones, I'm not sure how to pronounce the first name, but let's mute the lines. All right. That bad boy went up 56 points. Let's get the calculator. So if you would have came in with 10 cent times 56, that would have been $5.60. If you would have came in with $5 times 56, that would have been $280. If you would have came in with a $10 bid times 56, you would have made $560. And it all would have happened in six hours. In six hours. It all depends on how much you would have bid, right? You would have came in, whatever you would have bid with, it would have took six hours for you to cash out. You could do this from the comforts of your home in your draws. So you guys, last thing I'm gonna show you is most of the times people get into things and they're like, oh my gosh, is these one of those things where I'm gonna be by myself? No, you're not. Look at this community, Generation 12. I don't know who invited you, but if you got invited by somebody with Generation 12, this is our community. 
Shout out to Angelic for opening her live account today. She's excited. She's placing trades. Somebody just opened up their live Forex account today. Tonight at 11 o'clock, we got a cryptocurrency call. These young guys right here teaches us about cryptocurrency. We be wilding out in this group, y'all. Look at this. Somebody, let's go, Jilly. Yeah! Somebody just got started. Look at that. Look at how many people get started with us every day. I want y'all look at this. Shout out to Tiffany. Just got started. Right? Look at this. Somebody from Ghana. Where's she at? Ghana. Just got started. My little brother. Just got started. Ashley Brooks. Where Ashley? Just got started. These people ain't playing around. They know what they want and they going for it. Right? So inside this community, you're going to be able to mingle and talk with traders all around the world. Right? So check this out, family. Pretty much, this is our community. Uh, this is how it works. Um, if you're interested in knowing how to get start, uh, how it uh, how it works, how much it costs, get back with the person that invited you. They're probably going to get you on a call with me, a private call with me, and let's talk about it. Let's talk about how much it costs. Let's talk about how to get in, and let's talk about how you could trade, uh, how you could change your life, you guys. But I'm only interested in talking to people that's interested. So if you're not interested, then I won't be on the phone with you. But if you are interested, we'll lay the price down. We got some promotions. I want to be able to help you guys. So that has been my time here today. Once again, when you become a member with our community, you're getting the videos. That's going. That's only three to 11 minutes long, that's gonna teach you what Forex is. You're getting access to the Smart Money TV. You're getting access to the harmonic scanner that does 87% of the work. You're getting access to um, the community and you're getting mentorship. You get mentorship, not only from me, I'm not even gonna lie, I'm not making eight figures, right? I'm still learning this. But you do have the opportunity to learn from people making eight figures, get mentorship from people making eight figures, making a million a month, right? So that's been my time. Like I said, if you're interested, Sammy, Travis, Jamil, uh, Oya, go ahead, get back with whoever invited you. They're going to put you on the phone with me or another leader, and we're going to tell you how much it uh, uh, start, uh, get, starts to get cost. I mean, cost to get started, and I'll catch you guys at the beaches and the banks all around the world, y'all. Peace. See you at the beaches and banks. Let's go. Appreciate you, Isis. Appreciate love you.